Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we worship you. We give you the glory. We give you the adoration. Be exalted forever in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangel. Sarah, you're welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with the child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you. For you that is under the sound of my voice, I pray for you. May the hand of the Lord continue to rest upon you always in the name of Jesus. Please, family, help me to like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry, become a member, and God will bless you as you do that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. I, I feel this kind of joy inside of me as I'm giving this message. Child of God, you did the impossible. You did the impossible, yeah. It will not become something that you will not just exploded, like not being able to hold on anymore. Yes, you were at the breaking point. Let me speak to your life. This person, you were at the breaking point, but you hang in there. <laughs> you hang in there. It was just like the rope was almost cut off. You have every reason to like, oh, I am overwhelmed, I am tired, I'm frustrated, I'm this, I'm that. But you hold it down. Hmm. Glory to Jesus. That was like an impossible situation where you walk through. You know the Bible says he will lead you beside still waters. You don't even know how you did not break down. Yes, you didn't know how you did not break down. It is God that was leading you through that still waters. Yes, the book of Isaiah, the Bible says, when you pass through the waters, I will be with you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For God has broken the gate of Bar. He has destroyed the works of Satan. Let me sing for you. Have you heard what the Lord has done? He has destroyed the works of Satan. Yes. He has given us victory. That's why I will say, oh, say, yeah. hallelujah. God has destroyed the works of Satan. God has destroyed the works of Satan. Yes, the impossible become possible. You did the impossible, yes. And this person I'm speaking to in your life right now, there was a time that you almost gave up. You cried. There were some days you cried. You cried and you told God you were done. But you don't know how you keep doing it. You keep getting up. You just did the impossible. Because you were like, like at the middle of targets. I don't know when you are the center of targets. Being target. Being the target like you cannot make it through. There are many who were even watching you. Let's see how far you can go. Let's see how far you can go. <clears throat> In all of that, you push through. You push through. I want you to know that I am celebrating you now. Yes, nobody might have told you that, oh, you have done so well. You have done so well. Nobody might have told you that, oh, you did well by standing firm. You have done so well. Because I know sometimes it can be so exhausting that you just want to draw the curtain and say, mm, I am done. Yeah. Yes, there are days you just want to say, no, God does not exist. But you said, no, I will not say that. There are some days you just, you just feel frustrated at God, at yourself. But you, keep, you still keep it together. You keep it together. Those that were waiting for you to throw it away, they see that you did not throw it away. You held on to it. You held on to God. You did the impossible. One thing you should know, we serve a God that do miracle. We serve a God that make the impossibility possible. Hallelujah. And that God has been your strength. And that God will continue to be your strength. I want to congratulate you. I want to celebrate you for your courage. I pray may the Lord continue to strengthen you. May the Lord make his light shine upon you. In the name of Jesus, it is well with you, child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remember your sister, Evangelist Sarah. 
by the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.